Yeah. Having maybe four people stabbing on the battle side, it's, it's all right if one of them doesn't score, right? Yeah. But if you're making sure that one of them is scoring on one side, and then you have your whole team, you won't lose players like that. And it's uh, a, a bit of a safer way to make sure you're scoring those points. Moving down the lane. Three down on the red team. This is a perfect opportunity for the green team to push. They're wobbles right now. They're going to be the 441. It's as close as it gets. Yeah, Green Team right now is flawless TV, so it's really anyone's game. Green Team drops itself in their first loss of Pax East. Score just 20 points, Green Team behind. Something that will leave you might be a great idea at this point. In fact, Arendi is near a shard. You can check out the mini-map right there. Yeah. That yellow shard on the top right. Go break that, get some money. That's not going to be enough for an elite but, but it will lead you to that purchase. Shadowfire player there coming in from the enemy already, and she's going to have to get out of there. She's very low on life. You do see the Shepherd and Minions pushing on that right hand side. This could be some points for Team 1. Yeah, it looks like they're up at 460 now. Getting really close. If they score both of these that's just going to be the end of the game. All right, grabbing another augmentation right there on the Helix. Ten points away. Red Team looks like they might take their first W. That was back to East. Luckily, uh, there's no more minions on the left side, so I believe it's where they score it. So they're going to have a little bit of time to recover and hopefully notice that that's happening. So, yeah, a lot of players over here are weak on the right lane. Yeah, they're still stacked on 